The Russian view of these historic commemorative events in Berlin today is a little bit sour. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs spokeswoman Maria Zakharova said that, of course, Russia had always welcomed the vision of a united, peaceful, prosperous Europe without dividing lines. But they were still waiting to see that materialise in Europe 30 years after the fall of the wall. It had always been a Russian policy and always would be, but they were still waiting, she said. Now, that view perhaps seems a bit negative, but it's not only in Russia. In Germany, they issued an invitation to the Russians to attend, and there certainly is a Russian in attendance at the commemorations today, but it's not Vladimir Putin. The view across Russia also reflects a general lack of interest and indeed knowledge about these historic events. A couple of polls found that as many as one in four Russian youngsters aged between 18 and 24 had never even heard of the fall of the wall, and up to a fifth of 24 to 39-year-olds were similarly ignorant. Across the population, the figure's a bit better. 88% are aware of the fall of the wall, although a lot fewer know why it was built and exactly when. Generally speaking, people are fairly positive about the fall of the Berlin Wall, with 43% of Russians saying they see it as a positive event, although that figure does drop to only 30% of those 18 to 24-year-olds. And perhaps, after all, the view from the Kremlin is not so surprising after all, when one considers that it was only just over two years after the fall of the wall in December 1991, that the Soviet Union itself disappeared from the map.